Are you serious? Are you serious? What is this thing? A creature of some sort. Is it a big dog? It, uh, people are scared to death. I've been getting in emails from folks saying, Paul, is this a beast of some sort? A beast? A seven-foot beast? Well, this very weird uh, beast, I guess. Uh, to me, I think it looks like a, a really... A strange looking dog, maybe, but the uh, thing is huge. Uh, it's an unknown animal. According to reports, it's out of Santa Fe, Argentina. It's an unknown animal. It's said to roam the streets at night in Santa Fe, Argentina. It's not shy either of a confrontation. And according to local media there in Santa Fe, Argentina, the creature has already attacked two dogs. Now, they said the large animal killed a German shepherd and it killed a pit bull before disappearing. But one resident did get, apparently managed to get a picture, a quick picture of this beast. The thing can stand up on its hind feet and is about seven foot tall. It is an unknown animal roaming the streets at night in Santa Fe, Argentina. It was later shared, there was a, a, a video on YouTube that uh, people have been watching trying to figure out what it is. The viewers were left equally as terrified, even speculating what it could be. Uh, is, it, is it a beast of some sort? You know, the Bible does talk about uh, these beasts in the last days. That, that people will be killed from beasts of the earth. Uh, you know, I don't know. I mean, I've heard Russ Dizdar talk about potentially half man, half uh, satanic or, or demonic forces. We know that there were Nephilims back in the day. I mean, we can read about it in the book of Genesis, chapter 6. They were giant men. Now, this doesn't look like this. looks like the, the head on this thing looks like it might be a dog. But the body and the, and the legs do not look like uh, a dog's legs. So it's kind of a weird uh, photograph. Now, I have no idea if this thing was photoshopped or not. The reason I say that, I don't, I, I don't know. I'm just going to put it out there for you. You look at it. You tell me. Look at the thumbnail. I'll put the links below. You can check it out. There's also a video out there somewhere. You can grab that and, and maybe somebody can get a better take on what this thing is. Ever so often, there's always a weird, a, some kind of weird creature. Usually, they come out of the depths of the ocean. I mean, the Bible told us that Leviathan is in the ocean. Okay, the creature, the demon of the sea. We got the, we got a whole chapter on that in the Book of Job. But what is this thing? What? Well, there's a lot of unexplained things going on recently. We're going to try to make sense of this whole serious situation that has certainly got the whole world on edge. And uh, a whole lot more There's information breaking everywhere. We come within an eyelash of getting hit with an asteroid yesterday. Nobody even saw it coming. I even went to the uh, asteroid uh, chart just a few minutes ago. It's still not even on that chart. It's still not even on there. This thing come within 0.5 lunar distance of the Earth. We didn't know it existed. And remember, guys, I tell you that, that even though I can read the chart and says, okay, we don't get nothing to worry about today. That doesn't mean there isn't going to be an asteroid that's even going to hit us. This was a 20-meter rock that just scraped by the Earth. So we'll talk about that, this weird beast in Argentina, what's going on in the Middle East and Syria. Did Israel bomb that uh, Iranian air base in Aleppo? Well, there's reports everywhere that definitely an unidentified fighter jet did. Turkey says it was an identified fighter jet. Several. Russia says that uh, it was an identified fighter jet. Something caused the explosion. Now, the first reports were that these were Israeli jets. Israel will not confirm or deny. And if you're waiting on Israel to tell you whether they did or not, they blew up a Syrian nuclear facility in 2007 and never admitted they did it until a couple months ago. They waited 11 years and finally said, oh, by the way, we did we went in there, we blew it up. So if you're waiting on Israel to tell you whether or not they did it, forget it. Somebody did. Somebody definitely did. Uh, we'll be back with more current world events and how they relate to biblical prophecy.
What is this thing? Is this a beast? Are you serious? Don't miss tonight's live broadcast. Starts at 7 p.m. Eastern at my website at paulbigleyprophecy.com. That's paulbigleyprophecy.com. I'll also be here on this YouTube channel. 